Okay, guys, it's Tanika. I'm back. This is going to be part three of the haul. This is going to be Max stuff. So, um, and then there'll be some more later on. But this is part three. It's the final part of my haul. I promise you guys I won't pull out anything else. Um, next thing I got was a 214 smudger brush. Got that for underneath my eyes. Packing in some shadow for those folks that, you know, call for that. Got some MAC wipes from the counter. Also picked up um, from the CCO this quad called Angel Fire. I'll lift it up so you can see what it looks like. Haven't used it yet. I'm just, um, haven't had time really. But uh, when, I, when I do get to it, I will get to it. So, that was all the things that I got from MAC. And then I'll move on to the NARS. This is the ISO dual quad. Some neutral colors. There we go. That's a little bit better. It's like a gold and a copper. Bronzy gold. I swatched it on my hand, but this is it right here and here. I don't know that you can tell, though, because the light is kind of washing it out a little bit. But I got that with Sephora Family and Friends. I got some black soap that I haven't used. It smells a little weird. Like men's cologne, so I think that's why I won't use it. I'll get around to using it, but I ain't, I'm not excited about it. And um, Makeup Forever Dual Matte um, Powder Foundation. It's got this real cooling feel when you put it on, and it like you can feel it drying on your face. It puts me in mind of that. Um, there's that Mac. Here, no, that's not it. That loose powder is like liquid powder. I don't know. But I like it. It's it gives me light coverage. Um comes with a little sponge. That's what you see here. But um I'm gonna show you 214. This does what I need for you know when I'm not trying to be all well, I shouldn't say all made up. I do it for light coverage. When my skin is really, really, really dry. I use that. I use powders um, versus liquids because my liquids are real, real mattifying in the powders. They're mattifiers too, but they let some oil through and I just kind of dust it. I don't cake it on. I just dust it all over my face. And then um, got the Naked 2 palette. And I wasn't going to purchase it except for the fact that I can't find my um, first Naked palette. So. You've all seen these before. The colors really look very similar to what are in the um, other palette, to me, anyways. This is the brush you get with the package. You get this and you get something else, but this end of the brush is kind of like the, um, what am I trying to say? The blender brush. I want to blank for right there. Uh, feels okay. And then this part, they're synthetic bristles. This is kind of like uh, the other one that came with the Naked Palette. One, I guess. Um, I don't know. I wouldn't use this to put on eyeshadow. But maybe like concealer or something. So, um, I haven't used it yet. I'm just showing you guys what I picked up. And I do have a lot of Urban Decay palettes, so um, in this um, deal, I guess I can hold it like this, but that's going to blind you because the light is right behind, behind me. Let me see. There's a little... Oh, okay. Don't worry about that for now. But they show the colors on this little backboard back here. And of the colors that they show, I already have Half Baked, um, Suspect, Verve, and YDK. I think all the other ones are new. And they say five are new, so they're just probably spread out in some other collections. So, um, I'm excited about this. Even though I know you guys don't like it, I just dropped something trying to figure out what it was. But in that package came this look. Um, lip junkie it says cools and plumps. 
I don't think I'll use it for that. I'll probably give it away. But I like the little um, decorations on it. It reminds me of the Urban Decay uh, Quinceanera 5th Year Anniversary Palette. It's really pretty. It's a lot that went into that, I guess. And then because of my purchase, I got some Benefit Pore Professional. I guess the girl thought my pores were big, but she came back with that instead of some primer that she said she was going to give me. And then this Too Faced Lash, Lash Gasm. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Um, let me see how it looks like the wand. Oh, that's okay. Nice little wand. I have to try that. Okay. And what else? I believe that completes my haulage. Um, thank you guys for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, let me know what you guys picked up, if you picked up any other things and what you're debating on. And if you have any questions, um, most of what I've shown you, um, I haven't used much of it. But whatever feedback I can give you, I'd love to give it. And until next time, thanks. Bye-bye.